everyone welcome back to my channel if you are new here welcome if you are already subscribed welcome back my name is sierra and in today's video we are stuffing my last paycheck from may so i have the money right here in my bank bag and today we are stuffing 745 dollars so i'm gonna go ahead and set the money up i did make it to the bank this week um but i didn't have any hundreds that i'm gonna be stuffing so that's why you don't see any but today is friday so i hope you guys are all having a great start to your memorial day weekend um, i have quite a bit of plans this weekend so i'm probably not going to be able to edit this video until like sunday or monday i do have all for the holiday so i'm excited for that we are going to go on the ferry on saturday and then sunday you have a few barbecues to go to and then monday I am going to just do a bunch of prepping for the baby. I'm going to PA to look at a car and we just have a few other things to do. So editing normally takes me anywhere from like an hour and a half to two hours and then I have to create the thumbnail. So I just, I'm not gonna have time to do it today but I still wanted to at least film the video that way I can, you know, edit when I'm able to. So hopefully you guys all have a great Memorial Day weekend. Stay safe and have fun. But without further ado, we'll go ahead and get into the cash stuffing. All right, so starting off for this week, I am going to um, start off with my cash envelopes like I normally do. So starting off with myself, I am going to be stuffing $50. Um, just because we have quite a few things to do this weekend, I'm pretty sure I will find something to spend this money on um, or need to buy something for myself. So that's why I'm putting 50 in there instead of my normal 20 next is for the kids and i am also stuffing 50 for them so if you've ever been over to cape may new jersey they have like the ferry ride that takes you from lewis if you're from delaware i know quite a few subscribers are actually from delaware which is cool but the lewis ferry will take you to cape may new jersey and they have just a bunch of shops and cute stuff clothing stores just fun stuff to do um they have like carriage rides with horses so i'm pretty sure you know we'll have something fun to do but that's why i'm stuffing 50 for the kids as well because i know that there will be things that they're going to want um next is for dine out dine out i'm not stuffing moving on to groceries i am giving it it's normal 60 dollars, so 50 and then a 10 and this is just my portion of the groceries for those of you who are always shocked that i only spend 60 dollars a week on groceries honestly normally i do because it's most of the time just restocks on stuff but um the kid's dad of course does provide money for groceries as well so if i go over then i just use that which i have been going over a little bit recently because i've just been trying to make like different things um cool things like snacks and stuff for the kids so it's been costing me a little more but that's okay um next is for starbucks and starbucks this week is going to get ten dollars All right, moving on to nails. So nails is going to get 50 this week. I am gonna go at some point and get my nails done probably Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday night um, of next week. But I just wanna make sure I have the money in there to do that. And I'm probably gonna get just like a light pink color. Honestly, I'm so sick of looking at my swollen hands. It's not even funny. <laughs> like they're driving me nuts. I cannot wait to go back to my unswollen self because at this point I'm like 150% over being pregnant. So we have only a few weeks left before baby Preston makes his arrival and I cannot wait um, to just get back to like my normal routine. Like I feel like I'm just always tired. I just always feel beat and I want to get back to like making different type of content. Like I really want to do vlogs. I want to do just a bunch of different things, but the way my energy set up lately, I'm just I'm barely making it like with cash stuffings. Next is for necessities and I am stuffing nothing in this cuz we don't need anything and then gas is going to get 40 bucks. And then that wraps it up for my cash envelopes. And um, I do have all of these binders linked on my Amazon storefront. If you guys do want to check it out, it is linked down below in the description. I also have some really cute clothes on there for spring and summer and then maternity clothes as well. Um, I know a lot of you guys are also pregnant. So definitely check out my storefront in the description down below. All right, next is for uh, my long-term binders. So that's what we're gonna do this week. 
for some reason my tripod is like super shaky lately and it's annoying me and I don't know why it's like that all right anyway starting off with Aston so he's going to get $50 this week um, you guys know by now I normally give the kids $50 per week all right, and Aston now has 1,000 to 3,050, 1 and 50, so 3,150. Speaking of Mr. Aston, he's behind me currently. What are you eating? An apple. Oh my goodness. Watching monster trucks. If you hear monster trucks on TV, he has invaded my room and is watching a show. Um, all right, next is for Leia, and she is also going to get 50 bucks. I always like to keep it even, and she now has 1,000, 2, 3, 50, 1, and 50. So 3,150 for her. Moving along to family time. Family time is going to get $20 this week. I did take out $70 for our ferry trip that we're going on, so um, just to make sure we have, you know, money to do stuff and for tickets and things um, but anyway family time got 20 and now it has 20 40 60 81 20 40 and 60 so 160 for family time next is for vacation and vacation is going to get 50 bucks this week and that puts it at 152 20 40 60 83 and 20 so 320, um, I'm trying to figure out how I'm gonna do this going on vacation in July thing with having the new baby. I don't really feel right leaving him just yet and also with breastfeeding and everything, I'm gonna have to just figure out how we're gonna make this work. But I really wanna go and I honestly need a vacation. I need just a break from life and reality at this point. But I really don't wanna leave my newborn baby. He'll only be like, I don't know two weeks old at the time of his dad's birthday so i'm gonna have to figure something out i mean i can't bring him because that's just not gonna be fun at all I'm trying to have a vacation with the baby maybe i'll just put him in my suitcase kidding but i don't know i need to figure out what i'm gonna do because i just feel guilty like leaving a new baby like that i don't know we'll see um next is for the house account and it's going to get 20 bucks this week and it now has 1, 2, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, and 80. So 380 for the house account. All right, next is for business, and it is going to get $20 this week as well. And that puts it at 1, 2, 50, 70, 90, 3, 10, 30, 50, 70, and 90. So 390. Moving along to the surprise envelope, it is going to get $50 this week, and that puts it at 1, 2, 3, 54, 55, 56, 57, 20, and 40. So 740 for surprise. New whip, I'm not stuffing. And then that brings us along to our savings challenges. So. The $10,000 savings challenge this week is going to get $80. So, 50, 20, and a 10. And that gives it 1,000, 2, 1, 2, 3, 54, 55, 20, 40, 60, 86, 10, and 15. So $2,615 and it got 80. So just gonna cross that off. All right, next is for the $20 challenge and this is for saving $1,000. This is gonna go towards the baby's savings account. So I don't know if I'm going to get one now or I don't know. I'm not really in a rush to, to really get a savings account. As long as I'm continuing to save this, I feel fine. But 
So now it has 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 80, and three. So 300 for the $20 challenge. All right, and then the last thing in this binder is the Disney challenge. And it is going to get $60 this week, so 50 and then a 10. And I am going to be doing a condensing video. This envelope is the main reason why, but that will be up one day this week. I'm gonna do that. I've just, I've honestly been behind on videos. I haven't been getting anything done that I wanna get done, but I'm trying to cut myself some slack, so it's okay. But I promise there's a condensing video coming. All right, so Disney now has 50, 1, 50, 70, 90, 2, 10, 30, 50, 70, 90, 3, 10, 30, 50, 70, 90, 4, 10, 30, 50, 70, 90, 5, 10, 30, 50, 70, 90, 6, 10, 30, 50, 70, 90, 7, 10, 30, 50, 70, 90, 8, 10, 20, 30, and 40. <coughs> so 840 for Disney and... Yeah, this envelope is very thick. This binder in general is getting thick, which is not a bad thing, but I definitely need to condense it some. All right, next is for my short-term binder and we are gonna start off with Christmas. Christmas this week is going to get 10 bucks. Is that candy? Wow. My kid's candy spilled in my envelope. That's cute. Oh, don't come running because you heard candy. It's not candy that you could eat. Go sit. All right, so Christmas now has 1, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 5, and 200. So 200 bucks for Christmas. All right, next is for clothes, and clothes is going to get $20 this week, and it now has 1, 20, 40, 60, 82, 10, 20, and 30. So 2, 30 for clothes. Moving along to Amazon. Amazon is going to get 20 bucks, and that puts it at 20, 40, 60, 81. 20, 30, and 40. So 140 for Amazon. Next is for the YouTube giveaway, and giveaway this week is going to get $5. That gives it 50, 70, 5, 80, 5, 90, 5, 1, 0, 5, 10, and 15. So 115 for YouTube giveaway. Date night, I am not stuffing. It has a pretty good amount in it. And then last is for birthdays, and birthdays is going to get $10. And that puts it at 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, and 100. So I need to get my parents a birthday gift. I don't know what I'm gonna even get them. I feel like every year we kind of just do something rather than like gifts. Told you guys plenty of times we're not like a family that's into gifts like that like materialistic gifts i don't know i just feel like they're exciting for like a couple minutes and then it's like okay <laughs> but doing things making memories and stuff you know you always remember and you have that to cherish so that is probably what we'll do um actually you know what my dad is going to be in costa rica for his birthday so lucky him and then why did you ew Look at this. Why would you sit your chewed up apple on my desk? That is gross. Here. No, I don't want it. Go put it in the trash. I don't even know where it is. It's right out there. You know where the trash is? Here. Boys, I'll tell ya. But yeah, so my mom, she, I don't know. We'll probably, I'll do something nice for her. I don't know exactly what just yet. But then my daughter will be having a birthday. I can't believe she's going to be three. It's crazy to think that I'm going to have a three-year-old, a four-year-old, and then a newborn. 
I'm just like going through the motions lately. I feel like I'm not usually super emotional, but I've been pretty emotional lately. So I had the Duna car seat on my registry. If you guys know what the Duna is, it's like the car seat stroller in one. Um, it's a little expensive. It's like, I think $550. So I put it on there because I was like, maybe, you know, one of my family members will buy it. If not, obviously that's fine. I was going to, you know, get their dad to go half with me and, and get the stroller at some point if none of our family got it for us. So the other day he's like i have something you know i have a surprise for you i have something coming for you and i guess they double charged his bank statement when he ordered or his bank account when he ordered the stroller and he was asking me to like help him figure out like how to get the money back because he's like they you know charged me twice for the the item that i ordered and he was like yeah it was 150 dollars and blah 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 so this is supposed to be my surprise and i'm like oh it's probably like a pair of sneakers or something you know 150 dollars me in my head trying to guess what it is so the other day i come home and i pull in the driveway and there's a big duna box sitting there and i'm like oh my god like somebody actually ordered this stroller for me like I wasn't really expecting my family to or his family to pay that much i just like i said threw it on the registry just to see because you know maybe somebody would order it but when i came home um i saw it like i saw the big box sitting there and i just busted out crying because i was like i wanted this stroller so bad and um i looked on there to see like who it was from and it said to him and i was like did, is this my surprise so i like called him and i'm like crying like a freaking idiot in the driveway <laughs> like did you really buy this i wanted this so bad so yes i was so happy that he surprised me with that and got it and um he got it in the right color i wanted the like desert green color or like the army green color and it's so cute um so i'm so happy that i was able to get that stroller because it is pretty expensive and um, not gonna lie, I honestly, I didn't really <laughs> want to pay for it, but I was going to if it came down to it. Cause he's like, why do you need a stroller that's, that's that expensive? And I was like, I mean, I really want it. Like, it's, it's something I really wanted for the baby. Like, if there's one thing I really wanted is that stroller. So, super thankful that he ordered that and surprised me with it. But anyway, that is pretty much it for today's cash stuffing. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Oh, let me show you my new Starbucks cup. How cute is it? I'm like a Starbucks cup junkie, a tumbler junkie, if you will. I love cups, just any cups, honestly. Not even tumblers. I love mugs, anything that's cute, that's a cup. I like it. Um, what else do I have to tell you guys? I don't even know at this point. But, oh yeah, that's what I want to tell you. So, for the month of June, um, I'm not going to be posting as much. I'm taking the month of June as, like, my nesting month and just to really prepare for the baby and everything since he will be here, you know, next month. So close, yet so far away, but I'm going to take the time and just, you know, get everything organized. And I am going to be filming a what's in my hospital bag, and then I'm going to do the virtual baby shower type of thing like just showing you guys gifts and stuff that i got and i really want to do the hospital bag video because it's so different than my last two so i don't know it's just something that i want to do like a realistic hospital bag and not a whole suitcase like i did the last two times but i'll be doing those videos and then i'm going to do the condensing video so it'll be up next week at some point and I think that's it for now uh, my may schedule didn't really go as planned just because i i just haven't had the energy to make videos and at this point it's just gonna have to be okay <laughs> um tiktok is on pause as well until after the baby's birth i just i can't keep up with tiktok at this point um so yes i'm gonna still be doing my cash stuffings for june but extra videos probably not so much besides like the the baby bag and, and stuff like that but anyway um if you're not already subscribed make sure you guys do subscribe we are so close to 17,000. you guys know i'll be doing a giveaway i do have another replica bag coming actually two coming so i'll be giving those away as well um once i do the unboxing videos so that'll be something forward to look <laughs> something forward to look 
<laughs> that'll be something to look forward to and those videos will most likely be up in july that'll be separate of course from the 17,000 subscriber giveaway so stay tuned for those I definitely want to get back on track with like filming and everything once i'm back to my normal self but for now this is just what i'm able to give <laughs> so that is it that is all i'm gonna go get ready and then we're gonna go enjoy our day but i hope you guys all have a fantastic weekend please be safe out there and stay tuned for the upcoming videos and i will talk to you guys in my next one bye